Hi guys, it's Sunday. We are at Sarah and Tori's having some kind of Sunday dinner. I'm just going to show you. Pretending like he doesn't want to be in it. Sarah. Tori's just doing some washing up. And then I think Cardi's on the phone. And this is the flat that I said last week that we were doing um, house moving. And this is what they've done to it. Oh, hello again. <laughs> And we're watching 10 Things I Hate About You. Spinach and sweet potato, um, what do they call it? A tortilla or something. So it's like a Spanish omelette sort of thing. Amazing. So this is what Sarah's cooked. Cooked for Storm. <laughs> so we've got some kind of Spanish sweet potato, sweet potato and spinach omelette type thing. Chicken. <laughs> uh, with some roasted garlic and some vegetables. Is it paella? <laughs> Okay, look at this. The gym. So Chloe and Andy have just bought the most amazing puppy. What's it called? JD. JD. I hope this video does him justice how small he is. Hello. Hello. Hello, <laughs> <laughs> cutie. Oh yeah. my god, it's so cute. Hello. So it appears 24 7 fitness is turned into a pet shop. <laughs> <laughs> We've got new fish, new resident fish. Getting a black one next week with big eyes. And then here's JD just chilling. He's so cute. Hello, hello. James is making lunch because he's well trained like that. Show us your t shirt. Do you like it? Yeah, I really like it. That's what Sarah got him for his birthday. No? And that means lunch is ready. Sorry. So we just got back from Sainsbury's. We've done the like Easter egg trip for the weekend for the family. Um, so this is what we are currently dealing with right now. I've not had chocolate in forever. <laughs> So we've got um, a mini eggs one that's for James for eight weeks time. I got a caramel one, so we're just gonna keep those safe. Um, obviously until after the competition, then we'll look forward to that. I've got my mum a caramel one, my dad a flake one. James got that for his mum and dad. And then we've got these for the girls because we're seeing them on Saturday, James's nieces. And then, we were in two minds whether to like have a treat or not with it being Easter Sunday and going for a family meal so we've compromised and got some dark chocolate so when they're kind of digging into dessert that's going to be our Easter treat so just a little bit of that with a cup of coffee so I think that'll keep us satisfied but yeah this is currently what we're dealing with. for Easter now um, James actually let me drive for like a little bit of the journey but then I really needed a wee so we had to stop and then I bottled it um, so James is driving and the next stop we're gonna have our food and get a coffee I think as well because we're struggling today we're just hungry we trained this morning and um, had some like post-workout oats we've had breakfast but we just want to eat everything so um yeah, I'll film this weekend, I'll film little bits at home, you'll get to meet our parents as well. So this is the kind of dedication that you need when you are travelling, when you're on prep. Um, so I've got chicken, broccoli and sweet potato. It's cold, so it's not going to be great, but we've brought a little bit of Nando's sauce to jazz it up. And we are eating it in a McDonald's car park. So, um, 
So, uh, what do you think, James? Uh, it's pretty. It's pretty grim. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not but yeah, that's what you gotta do. <laughs> this is what we do every car journey. We put the Phantom of the Opera soundtrack on and we sing really loud. <laughs> We've just got home and dad played a fun joke on us. So apparently this is our Easter present. He said because we're on a diet, he just got us some mini eggs and he's left all but two. <laughs> I ate the rest. This is my dad. Got Hi guys! <laughs> Don't you take this as well. Hi guys! Oh god, does he uh, try try what? like saying hello in a video without saying hi guys? What else do you say? Hello, good evening, and welcome. You like that? <laughs> welcome to the horror show. Talking, it's a map to YouTube. So, if you've got any ideas on how else to say hi to a video, hi Bonjour. YouTubers. Bonjour. This is my mum. Hola. Yeah, but like when you say like, hi guys. Hi YouTubers, welcome to my blog. <laughs> That's enough. That's enough. I can't even cook. And we're having oh, a lovely oh, meal oh, of that's chicken, that's broccoli, the carrots. Carrot. Potato, and they've Broccoli. even done sweet potato uh, chains. Where is it? Oh, it's really good. Oh, it's really good. Oh, it's really good. Oh, it's really good. One. This is really nerve wracking. <gasps> oh. oh. <laughs> zero. <In> no. <laughs> Go on. Two. I'm fearing for my life. I'm driving home on the motorway for the first time. James is scared. <laughs> this is our current Monday afternoon situation. <laughs> right, well, let me zoom in. Morning, guys. I thought I'd end the vlog here. We got back quite late last night. Um, after a really nice weekend at home, we only stayed for one night though this time and um, yeah we're having a lazy day today, we might go and do a bit of cardio later but the weather is horrendous um, so at the moment we've currently got um, the duvet on the sofa and lots of hot drinks and we're playing on Battlefront on the Playstation and I'm still in my pyjamas as well, <laughs> I thought I'd put a bit of makeup on just to make myself feel alive um, but yeah, all in all, we're eight weeks out. We've had um, a really nice weekend. Our family are really great in that they accommodate our diet. So both days we just had meat, vegetables, potato. Um, we didn't have any Easter eggs. We had to watch other people have eggs and the like. But we did have a little bit of dark chocolate and that worked exactly how I wanted it to work because when they all had dessert, we sat there with a coffee and just a little bit of like lint dark chocolate and then... Um, it just meant that we were getting a treat as well, even though it wasn't as bad as if we were going to crack open, open an Easter egg. We've got so many Easter eggs um, that our family have bought us and we got in last night and the first thing I did was put them in a box and taped up the box. I wanted to film it for you so that you guys could hold me accountable um, and say, right, these are the exact eggs that we've got. If they don't show you these eggs in like eight weeks time, it means that we've eaten them. Um, but I didn't even wait for that, I just taped them up. Um, progress wise, it's been a weird one this week. I've not lost on the scales, but I feel like I've lost. Like I just feel so much leaner. Um, my definition's definitely starting to come through, people are noticing. Um, so yeah, it just goes that you can't always go by what the scales say. Because I know for a fact that I've lost body fat, but on the scales I wouldn't be able to tell that I have. 
Um, diet's been really good. I'm not even bored of it yet. And I think like, because we're only doing the one competition this year, we're just getting on with it. We're not feeling sorry for ourselves. We're not kind of like giving ourselves a reason to swear. And um, yeah, we're just kind of getting on with it. And we've only got eight weeks left now. And I'm not even kidding. It, that sounds like a long time, like two months is a long time. But in terms of losing body fat that your body doesn't want to lose, it's really not a long time. Like eight weeks will go so quickly. And each one of those weeks definitely counts. Um, so yeah, that's all I've got to tell you. Had a really nice Easter. I hope you all have as well. And I'll see you next week. And we will be seven weeks out. That is insane. So see you later, guys.